It is common on Halloween for people to dress as soulless, life-destroying monsters. If so, would it be immoral to attend a costume party dressed <laughs> dress as Immanuel Kant? I don't think it would be immoral, but it would certainly be boring. Immanuel Kant is the most boring person ever. You know his life. He walked around the block once a week. If his dress is anything like his life, Mr. Moen in, uh, in uh, Out of the Shrugged would be a colorful, flamboyant figure by contrast. Now, in, in Halloween, in my day, you dressed, you know, as wild witches, dragons, monsters, but not as people. The fact that it was a person per se would disqualify you because we're going into the, into the world uh, of fantasy. If you dressed as Kant, you would have to keep the reality meaning of his ideas out of your head. You'd have to just go as, this is a bad guy, like a warlock. But if you kept in mind the concentration camps, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, you couldn't do it any more than could you go and have a fun Halloween dressed as Hitler with a little, a little mustache and a coterie saying Sieg Heil. If it means anything to you, couldn't do it. The only thing I could think maybe dressed like Kant, have a large mock-up of the Critique of Pure Reason, and every 15 minutes burn uh, uh, one page, and then burn your clothes down to the last piece, and then bob for some new outfit, maybe Aristotle's clothes.